So we're seeing lots of high levels of all kinds of different tree pollens right now. Dr. Ty Coleman from Allergy Partners of the Midlands says springtime allergies are in full swing across the area. It's something the weather team at WLTX has been tracking over the past few weeks. Tree pollen is high. That's going to be the case today, tomorrow, and it jumps up to about 11.3 on Wednesday. Our allergy season comes at a time when the flu and coronavirus are also concerns in the Midlands and across the world. The symptoms of these illnesses can sometimes look the same, but Dr. Coleman says there are key differences between your common allergies and a more serious infection. If you don't have a fever, it would be unlikely you'd be suffering from a, a viral infection. But some of the nasal symptoms could seem somewhat similar. A flu-like illness or infection will cause body aches and fatigues that you do not get from seasonal allergies. Allergy symptoms usually just from the neck up, itchy, sneezy, watery, typically not affecting the whole body in that sort of, um, you know, infectious kind of way. You'll likely see your car covered in yellow pollen, which is a good indicator that levels are high, but the pollen you cannot see in the air is most often the root of many people's seasonal allergies. To alleviate some allergy symptoms, it is best to limit times outdoors, wash your clothes often, and keep doors and windows closed in your house. Dr. Coleman also recommends using over-the-counter medications. Monitor your symptoms, and if you're not getting relief you need, then finding a good board-certified allergist would be a good place to start. In West Columbia, Danielle Miller, News 19, WLTX.